Hi friends, Emily here. I just finished an Amazon coloring book and supply haul video for the month of April. And I showed briefly this book with a few others and said I would do individual flip throughs. So that's what I'm doing here. I will link my Amazon haul video below if you missed it. So we're going to review Zen Doodle Coloring <clears throat> Birds in the Forest by Denise Cleet. This is brand new. It's a nice, heavy, look how heavy this book is. Very heavy book. It has thick pages. She also did the one Mermaids, which I have, and I believe I've shown some coloring pages in that before. So this is on par. It's that cute, whimsical. This The birds in this kind of remind me of that um, tablet game or the iPad or iPhone game. Um, it's been around forever where you do a slingshot and you kill the birds. And I can't remember the name of it, <clears throat> but you probably know what I'm talking about. <laughs> um, what's that game called? It's like a bird multiplying game. Um, these, by the way, are single-sided and they're nice thick kind of cardstocky pages. What I like about her books um, is there's a lot of white space. So you can do fun things in the background. You can put templates like stencils over it and shade over the shapes of the stencils with like um, your chalks or pan pastels. Um, you can blend markers, water. So there's lots of fun things you can do in the white space on some of her pages. Is this in the camera all the way? Anyway, so this is lots of fun. I really like this book. Flowers and woods and kind of whimsical Zen Doodle designs. They're kind of comical. Also, this bird reminds me of the bird in Aladdin and the original animated Aladdin. Um, Zazu, is it Zazu? I oh, know, not Aladdin, the Lion King. Yeah, the Lion King, Zazu, right? <clears throat> I think. This one's neat, it's half underwater and half above the water. So here we have more of that white space. Great opportunity for this book to practice how to do backgrounds. And I loved this one, like the big heart, all the shrubberies and these cute little birds. This is a tree just filled with vines and birds. That guy's kind of funny. Lots of clouds, if you want to practice clouds. I'm not quite sure why there's a bear in all these pictures. A bear and birds, but that's, you know, odd. For me, this looks like it's a retro background, but I think this is supposed to be some kind of fence, maybe. I would just do that like colored squares. <laughs> There's that bear again. Okay, oops, did I miss something? This one's fun. The flowers. Sagging tulips, sunflowers. There were a lot of other coloring books in my haul that I did full flip throughs on the haul video because they're shorter books and like inexpensive books, but these are a little more pricey book, probably about $10, $10 to $15, depending on Amazon's sale of the day. But better quality paper, a lot more individual designs. This one's hilarious. Where's Waldo? There you are. <laughs> I love the flamingos. The thing is with this book, there's just so many pictures. Like you could only do some like five or six or then seven. You're like, it becomes, it feels like a little like you're doing a lot of the same. I mean, I guess there's enough variety, but the birds are kind of the same. Ones you see over and over. That one's cute. Oh, the little owls in the sleigh.
Christmas birds. It's getting pretty thick at the back of the book here. Ice skating. That one's cute. Winter, winter. See what I mean? Just a lot of birds hanging and on wires, a lot of the same. That's odd. What is that? That's kind of funny. But I do love Denise Cleet's books and I love the mermaid book. It's so much. Oh, see, this mermaid is the one you see throughout that whole book. Um, lots of fun scenes. This reminds me of it a lot. So I, I like her style. This one's fun. It's just like fun, relaxing um, coloring. Let your imagination take flight in stunning color. She's from Canada. Sanctuary of Quirky Birds with 60 illustrations, you guys. Nice, big, chunky book. Check it out below. I'll link it on Amazon. I hope you like it. Keep an eye out next for the next video. I'm going to do a flip through of this one, Mythographic Aviary, in a separate video. I'll link below and upload it at the same time. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you then.